yeah um i i am interested into uh, power bi and dashboards like personally i love uh, seeing what? data visually i think I, we have some question also about hr analytics so i would like to combine both yes. so um yeah so how matters is so if i see an excel sheet with a lot of data there it's very difficult for me but when i want to see the analytics i would like to see graphs bar charts you know uh, pie charts all those things so uh, there is one very interesting page on instagram i used to follow about india in pixels i'm not sure how many of us follow this or maybe have seen this page but there is only one thing they do they pull data from government websites uh maybe if you are online right now you can just have a look at it quickly uh and see how they present it right it's just always all the posts what they are showing it's about india maps and on various uh, points so they pull data from different uh, government sources and they just show it like simple like today i saw uh, uh, in one of the posts that uh, how many vegetarian people are there in uh, india and what is the percentage okay it's as simple as that right so and there are so many problems so many problem statement you just have to keep your eyes and ears open so many problem statements you will see that you don't have to write hello world programs right so you can do something which is like to few months back in my area like few friends of mine and i was working together and we have literally solved a local transport pmp ml problem and it is a real time problem we worked with pmp ml authorities the pune local bus authorities and we have sorted it out it helped me building a bus route from the nearest metro station to my office also oh. same model i applied there it was just done in a jiffy right in 3 3 weeks time actually a bus is running from my office to metro station so wow. this is how real time problems can be solved and can be addressed so don't look at the existing data or maybe existing problems in a different way that is secondary first try to solve a real time problem which is you are seeing that it's a and it can be a problem in your own life in your own house right it can be anything right so if let's say if there is a financial uh, maybe you want to apply something can you develop a model which will predict uh, your expenses in next quarter this can be a easy problem you can cater to and you can show this to your family first that yes this is what i have if you are staying alone this will help you in big 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 way that you can plan your finances accordingly anything which you are seeing uh simple expenses that uh, you put your logic you put data together and you have a solution and you are skilled i am not skilled you are skilled with those uh, tech stack you can definitely write something which will be build something and then simple see as an interviewer for me it is i do not prepare for interviews i will look at the profile and i will ask one question please tell me something about yourself and that is the time when i will glance at your profile and then i will find something interesting what you will talk about and i'll start building story from there i will weave stories on your input as an interviewer it is my uh, it's kind of a guideline i follow that i will talk 20% and i'll make you talk 80% of the time and for that you have to give me input if you start giving me yes no type of answers it's very difficult for me to build something which is on that and then the interview becomes dull then i lost i lose interest in you as an interviewer so for that you have to make your story interesting in an interview you have to show something which is interesting i read books i like music is a very boring answer because everyone gives that but then if i tell you that okay i am a rider and i have rode from pune to arunachal on bike this is something interesting will catch my eye so this is how your project and portfolio also should work what different you have done oh this is a very interesting insight can you tell me more about it this is an open ended question and i will ask and then you will start telling stories their communication doesn't matter i mean how it matters is how your how your thought process and how your flow of thoughts has been right it doesn't matter if you make grammatical mistakes there it doesn't matter uh, how you are coming and telling me the answer i know english is little over hyped language here in india because we feel that someone who talks in english is superior no doesn't matter how your thought process has been it matters it doesn't matter if i make a mistake while talking uh, mistake is happening because you are not confident that's fine how your uh, 
how you have put that thought and how it has graphic has come up that will matter me more when in an interview when you are you know sharing something which is so maybe uh, if someone can just put in the chat that what is the most interesting topic you have we can talk about it right so what is the most interesting topic you felt that okay you should give an answer or you can find a solution you just put it and try to find your own answers so these hackathons right they will give you they most of the times they will not give you a problem statement they will tell you a theme and you have to find a problem statement you have to come up with a solution and then you have to present in your own way consider each and every single theme of your life around you transportation it could be water solution it could be uh, uh, simple if you want to build your house how will you put your expenses what will be the cost what will be the time everything see you just look around you will find uh, a problem statement because yes there are a lot of problems and problem need not be something which is uh, which has to be grave and very this simple problems if i want to prepare for an interview what all things i should cover and what all the skill set i should look at put it as a problem statement and create those storylines on your uh, maybe graphic or maybe keep it as a project in python i think that okay i am at maybe 3 out of 5 i want to reach 4 problem statement put it in their story that's how i think you can build a portfolio and interesting topics 